Should you add the MAP61 to your toolbox? I'm Julian, the product manager behind this new camera. Let me show you what use cases this new workhorse enables for you. We have designed this payload by combining a 61 megapixel camera with a wide angle lens and this maximizes efficiency in the field and it unlocks additional 3D use cases. So let's take a look at the data. Let's say you'd like to map the London airport in south of Canada. On such an airport project, it's very costly to keep the airspace free for a long time. So you better want to map this site in a short amount of time. So what we can see, it's a 1,500 acres field. So that's pretty big. And with the RX-1, it would have taken us roughly six flights. And let's be honest, six flights normally take us more than half a day, right? So if we now go with the MAP-61, we can cover the same project on the same flight height, so also 400 feet, also same overlaps in less than 100 minutes of flight time. The additional benefit that you get from the MAP-61 camera is its 3D nature and the 3D digital twins and data sets that you can create. So the camera is tilted slightly to the front and that means that you can map vertical facades to the front and to the sides without the need of flying a crosshatch pattern. So in this model, you can see that the 3D nature of the camera allows you to create this stunning reality layer, which is an important piece of any digital twin, for example, of a town or of a city, but also of an industrial complex. And in the case of such a residential development, this information can be used to update the building cadaster of local authorities. So you can go into the data, measure building footprints as well as number of stories and area per story and update your GIS layer with this data. The third use case that I want to highlight is the camera's perfect fit for in-pit mapping and high wall stability use cases in mining. In this case, the customer has three active pushbacks in this pit and he wants regular updates of those as frequently as possible. So combine efficiency and the 3D nature of this camera and you get the right tool for the job. So in this case, you get not even great results on the flat areas in the pit, but also especially on the close to vertical facades on the high walls. I hope this insight sparked the interest, at least of some of you. If you're interested to learn more, subscribe to our webinar, which is upcoming in November and reach out to your local dealer to learn more.